This video covers anchored MaxDiff, which is a way to add absolute importance to MaxDiff results. We're going to do a brief review of MaxDiff, talk about what anchored MaxDiff looks like, and how to read scores. We've got a lot of information on our site, including basic introductions to MaxDiff, if you want to check them out. Now remember that MaxDiff takes a large number of items, puts them into an experimental design, and pushes a few items at a time back to respondents, asking them to check what is most important or least important to them or most preferred and least preferred. So they simply make those choices. We're forcing respondents to make trade-offs, and this results in really good discrimination between items. The results get placed on a 100-point scale, and they're very easy to interpret. This is ratio scale data, allows us to say that a score of a 10 is twice as important as a score of a 5. So MaxDiff helps us understand the relative importance of items. It does that very well. What about absolute importance? Well, anchored MaxDiff takes a question like this. Following the last screen of the MaxDiff exercise, a multiple select question is placed that includes all the items presented in the MaxDiff exercise. Respondents are asked to check the items that they consider very important in their decision. Now, what we get is an anchor of 100 that's derived by modeling a combination of the trade-offs that respondents made between the items that are most and least important to them and that follow-up question that asks them to select the items very important in influencing their decision to take some action. When you get the scores back, they look like this. We've got some items that fall above 100, and these are considered important enough to impact the action. They're absolutely important. Here we have our 100 anchor, and then below that, these are items that fall below that threshold of absolute importance. So like regular max diff scores, they're on a ratio scale. We can say that a score of 180 is twice as important as a score of 90. So we look at these important scores to give you a sense of the relative importance of items but we also look at the scores that fall above the anchor, that threshold, to give you an absolute sense of what's truly going to have an effect. Check out more of our content on our website, and give us a call if you have any questions. Thanks.